Hello everybody, this is Zigzag Zog coming to you from Western Kentucky, and we're back to continue our playthrough of XCOM 2 War of the Chosen featuring Long War of the Chosen. And boy, has it been busy lately. Uh, we left off with an ambush. Uh, I paused the recording so we could just get started and, and start this episode off with the ambush. So fingers are crossed that we can extricate uh, our, our covert action operatives uh, successfully. We're going to find out. It's been ages. It feels like it's been ages since I've done one of these. Uh, so let's hope it goes well. Your attempts at subterfuge have failed, and this defeat will be a costly one. Okay, the lost are known to be present in the surrounding area. Caution advised. Operation Hell Prince. Emergency extraction of covert XCOM operatives. Um, here we go. Let's hope it goes well. You've got no time to waste. Break cover and move to the extraction point on the double. <laughs> run, run, run. <laughs> Let's take a quick peek and refresh ourselves on who we've got on this mission. We've got a rookie. Please choose me. And uh, right now his name should be, please get me the heck out of here. Uh, Toshi. Toshi, the illusionist. Now hopefully you can perform a little illusion and get yourself out of here. Oh my goodness. How are we going to do this? And finally... We've got, uh, you know you want to be me. So we're looking at a couple rookies, unfortunately. So uh, there's not a lot of firepower to help us out here. We're just going to be run, 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 running. <laughs> Try and get ourselves out of here. Holy smokes, holy smokes, holy smokes. Let's go see. The evacuation point is way, way in the back. We've got to navigate the lost along the way. Um... We're going to have drop-ins uh, as far as uh, the advent is concerned. Uh, so let's just get this motor and try and figure out the best place for us to position ourselves. Are we near an edge? We're near the edge on this side. Uh, so maybe, just maybe, that's the direction we need to head. Here I come! Um... I think we will, I don't know that we have to worry about cover this very first turn. I think what we need to do is get moving just as fast as we can. I don't know that any drop-in advents are going to get a shot on us on their drop-in turn. Uh, if I'm wrong, boy, we're going to pay. Huh? <laughs> it's been so long, I'm trying to remember exactly how this may Be run. Simple. But that's why we're playing. We're trying to get familiar with uh, Long War II again, and specifically Long War of the Chosen. Uh, here we go. Run, run, run. Let's see what kind of drop-ins we're going to get here. Enemies moving on our position. Raised one, your team is compromised. We're picking up Advent Response Forces inbound on your position. Okay, so I seem to recall that they dropped in quicker than this, like on the very first turn. So we get one more grace move uh, to try and get moving through here. Um, there's a little more cover on the inside. Should we need it? I think what we're going to do is start out uh, by running up to this corner and see okay, what we confirmed. see. So far, nothing. So far, nothing. So far, nothing. Uh, Toshi, you can get a little farther than everybody else. Let's run, let's run you. Speed is our friend in this situation. Looks like we got some lost or potential advent troops roaming around up ahead. Those look like officer and trooper, maybe. Advent forces on the ground. Okay, they're catty corner. They're over on the other side of the building. They're going to have to run towards us. Maybe, just maybe, we can outpace them. It's an advanced officer, by the way, so uh, the firepower needed to take him down and an advanced trooper. Okay, they're not going to make this easy on us, are they? 
They are not going to make this easy. Um, ideally, I would like to hope. Although it doesn't look like this is a balcony. Oh, there's a balcony over on the side. The question is, yeah, I should just be able to get to it, maybe. Um, are they going to be able to run up enough to be able, even if they ran all the way quarter, I think I'd be out of range by dashing. Um, so, uh, let's start out with a blue move just to make sure we don't see anybody. I'm just nervous about doing a, a double move into the unknown. You're going to be in cover here by doing your double move. You know you want to be me, so let's uh, have you start out with the double move. Keeping Toshi's running gun in our back pocket. Okay. We have some enemy troops. Fortunately, regular troopers. That's uh, a small benefit to us. Uh, we have the ability to run and gun, but not quite the ability to get super close on this run and gun. Um, who else do we have available? And you're not really going to get a shot. Uh, we need you. Toshi? I don't know. Um, right now, it's not high percentage shots. And if I move you up here, Toshi, you are going to totally get flanked by the other trooper that we can't take out. Hmm. Mm -hmm. And I can't get you, please choose me. I cannot get you far enough forward. Well, I think uh, this only gets you range on the guys behind you. <laughs> so we definitely got a dash to get you out of line of sight. And, and we can't even get you on the other side of this vehicle. Holy smokes, this is not ideal and good for us. Now we're gonna have to put you right here. I gotta decide out decide now, Toshi, what we can have you do for us. Um, if we bring you up closer, we might be able to get a decent enough arc thrower shot, I'm thinking. Uh, with your arc thrower or arc pulser. Do we have miss you know, if you miss, do we have that? Disorients when it misses, so at least even a miss might help on this guy. Question being, can he reach this cover enough? So if we do a running gun to here, and we'll try the arc thrower, so you hopefully you can't get flanked from that point. Going in for the kill. Heading out. Definitely going to be vulnerable. Well, let's check the arc pulser and see what oh, horrible percents, horrible percents. But let's hope we at least disorient him with a miss. And best case scenario, we take him out, 45%. Ryo. Oh, come on, he's disoriented yeah. at least, so his shot hopefully won't be that good. Now that Evan Trooper is trying to get over to a better shot. Toshi gets a big time hit. Feeling nervous, feeling nervous, feeling nervous and scared. Um, I'm now worried about these guys in the back that we can't see. Where the heck are they? Um, Toshi, we can get you maybe, maybe if we move you inside, we can take care of one of these and also have you in cover. Um, or is it better to have you a little closer in full cover? Good, tough question. We're going to bring you behind the full cover right here. On the move. Unfortunately, the trailing Advent soldiers might be close enough. Just might be close enough to catch up to us, and I'm worried about that. Um, let's see. We bring you in this cover right here. A little bit nervous, a little bit nervous, a little bit nervous. I'd a a at least be able to get a flank here, but I'm allowing these guys to catch up. After that, I could get up a ladder and start run, 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 running, maybe, if we're lucky. I don't know. I don't know. 
I'm afraid if we come right here for a nice close range shot that the, the trailing soldiers will catch up and get line of sight on me. Uh, so I'm thinking, uh, you know you want to be me. Let's bring you right over here to see what your shot will be like. So at least the guys in front of us are out of the way. And uh, we are going to get motoring up high. Up top, up high. Moving out. I hope the other two can survive the trailers that are coming after him. After them. Oh, we got lost going active now. Just what we don't need is lost coming after us. But hopefully by getting up to the second story that'll delay their being able to get to us. And fortunately, those last two trailing soldiers did not catch up to us. Um, let's get in here. This is please choose me right now. Let's get you up here. Let's move already. And uh, we will start motoring. You're my lead guy to scout the way. Everybody else is need to needs to bring up the rear. We're not going to park you there, Toshi. We're going to try and let you get up the ladder first. Hopefully, you can get farther inside and hopefully out of danger. I'm all over it. And finally. No, you want to be me. Let's get you up to the window oh, to sneak on in there. Really worried about losing Toshi with only two hit points. Uh, he does have a med kit, so he may have to slow down. Give a chance for you know you want to be me to catch up. Let's open this door. far back. Oh, we're getting close. We're getting close. The question is, Finally. is there going to be overwatch? Is there going to be a lot of activity down there as we try to make our escape? Um, I think we're going to just go up to the doorway. Please choose me has just led the way and let us know it's safe. Toshi, we're going to bring you up behind. And fortunately, you have a med kit. We're going to use that med we'll kit fine. right now. least hopefully if we're staying in cover you can't get killed now you're gonna be out uh, injury time but hopefully that means we can get you out of here there's still a long way to go yeah they're following up they're behind us it's probably the loss down below that we're hearing and they're coming up the ladder <laughs> the best to get out now obviously we want to get out the window or if we can get near the window and then be able to dash out that would be awesome um, I'm kind of thinking as far as the lost go on this side is I, I don't know that there's a ladder if we get into this last room oh there is a ladder back here in the corner where they could access us so we can't be parking around too terribly long trying to get out of here um, I think what we'll do, do is we'll bring you here, let the other two catch up, hopefully. Roger that. And finally, you know you want to be me. Let's hightail it out of here for you, too. Um, as far as we allez, can get. Allez, allez. We're going to have one Overwatch available if they're able to run far enough. Um, here we go. Please choose me. Help protect us. Cover. Okay, our question now. Can we all three make it in a dash to get out of here? All right, that's just what we're doing. Um... You know you want to be me. Lead the way. Get us out of this sticky situation as fast as possible. I don't care if there's other troopers down here. You can wave as we go. 
<laughs> wave, wave, wave. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Please choose me. Come on down here. Move, move, move. So we're very fortunate that that first group. Uh, in fact, why don't we just run and gun? I'm coming for you. You never know. We might be able to Got it. pick up a kill on the way out. Get a little revenge for your injury. Big old miss. All right, let's get everybody out of here. I can't believe I'm we gone. made it after that initial start that we had. We got lucky that the reinforcement didn't land on top of us because I've had that happen before. All right, here we go. The sneaky team, the battle of New Brazil. Victory for XCOM, victory for Earth. I've just got a big sigh of relief coming out of me right now that we made it out alive. A little tougher hit on Toshi. And we might not have made it. It was that close. That close. He was down to two ticks, I believe, on his health. I don't like being made uncomfortable by this game and that, that mission. Made it back whole and the aliens paid the price. <laughs> Great work, Commander. Well, we got a bunch of promotions out of this. That's wonderful. Uh, Toshi, unfortunately, we've uh, learned to start liking you and your abilities, but you're going to be out for 17 freaking days. So a long time, long time, but thanks for your help on the covert op. Measly little items recovered, not really that exciting. I'm glad to see our joint effort paid off like we hoped. Shoo! Okay, so we, we brought the extra soldier, I think it was to uh, not have an injury, <laughs> uh, but we ended up getting an injury by being ambushed. So it looks like, uh, yeah, we already knew that the warlock was hiding down there. Um, so fortunately, I think we completed the mission and we got the info that we needed. We picked up some new information on the Chosen during our last covert action. Very good, very good, very You're good. You're starting to win over my people, Commander. And that says something. And that's the point, is get some new orders that we're able to start stacking up. That's why I decided to go for the we warlock. So well. Sounds like my Reapers can take on Ooh, some new orders. Look at that. Two resistance contacts just for free. Um, I like that. That Every little bit helps me delay um, that building in our, you know, that we've been looking to build. We'll have to examine that. When I have a chance, I'll go in there and examine that. But with two more, if I'm able to use this resistance order, that gives me two more resistance contacts. That would be awesome. So we got promotions, promotions, promotions. And we're gonna see and Our assign ourselves a new mission. Has motivated them to share some new information on the chosen. Um, ideally, I'm sitting here looking at uh, the possibility to recruit an engineer. What does it require? We can gain dodge on somebody and uh, wants alloys, which I will not spend. We're gonna have to take the risk of a soldier wound because uh, for everything I'm trying to build right now, there's no way I'm going to spend 25 alien alloys. Uh, we're just going to have to risk the wound. Um, let's go see who might be available. As a matter of fact, I'll pause right here at this moment and take my time to pick out who I want to go out on this covert mission. When we come back, we'll introduce you to who we chose. All right, we are back, and I've got the two soldiers that are going out on this recruit engineer covert op. Uh, James Douglas, uh, who is actually an unnamed uh, um, squatty rookie slash whatever, uh, but he got he went through training and he is our newest shinobi. So since the reward on this one is dodge plus five, I decided to just uh, rather than rename him and get him out there yet. You got a little time if you want to be a shinobi. Uh, this squatty is going to gain some more dodge to help him out as our shinobi. And he is available, so let me know when he's out of covert if you're going to want to uh, become this character. And f also, uh, another rookie that we have yet to promote and find out what class he's going to be 
you want to you know you want to be me is also going out on this for our new engineer so uh, we got a couple people available for those of you looking to get to be a part of this playthrough uh, so let's send them out they're gonna risk being wounded but that's the way it goes sometimes I'll order my people to get underway immediately hopefully uh, we won't get ambushed twice in a row hopefully the warlock isn't that good uh, let's get back into it and let's get back out there and uh, search for this intel that was uh, causing so much trouble. Oh, advent, retaliation, resistance, havens under assault. Uh, Commander, advent has discovered one of our resistance havens. They are targeting resistance members in a reprisal strike. Let's go find out where. All sorts of bad things are happening right now, and we did see the strength build up here. Um, what we're going to have to do is a quick response mission. So we're going to have one day and zero hours to put together a defense of our haven. Uh, fortunately, it looks like we do have a fair amount of soldiers available. Um, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Um, I'm going to cancel at the moment real quick because what I need to do is give myself time to figure out who we're going to put together for this mission. Um, and uh, yes, exactly, right there. One day, I know, I know. Uh, we're going to come out here and uh, this is where, this is going to be an extremely short little episode. Uh, but what I need to do is look through my soldiers. This is our first retaliation style mission. And uh, I want to make sure I put together the right team for that. And uh, we'll be coming back as soon uh, or on the next episode. So I'm, I, we'll see how I release these if I do two missions in one day because of this one being so short. Who knows? This is a new territory for me on how these missions are unfolding and heading in front of us. Um, so we'll see. i got to think on this one I haven't done, and I may want to research a little bit about these retaliation missions to get an idea of what we're going to be up against, too. That scares me because I'm really going in blind on this one without a lot of knowledge. Like I said, it's been a while since we played Long War II, and I want to get this right for you all. Um, so this is Zigzag Zog signing off from Western Kentucky. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it every time you hit that play button. Uh, when you go into YouTube, I appreciate it. Y'all have a great day. Auf Wiedersehen.